What's up guys, it's Alex the Magician here and in this video I'm just going to do a quick demonstration on how to take a Griffin Conservatory with Luna on three firewalls and just a few pixies. So this is one of the most useful things that Luna can do. Obviously, if you can take a cons and get a few angels for the price of just a few pixies and a few firewalls, then that's going to be really useful. It's going to help you do a lot of stuff with your side heroes. It's going to help you take more difficult fights with Luna because the angels have the speed 12 and they can kite a lot more. So yeah, this is a really useful thing to learn. So there's a couple of things that you need to know. First of all, the most important thing is that you need to actually be doing enough damage to finish the Griffins with a double firewall. You are going to be using a double firewall for this technique. So what that means is that for a size 1 cons, you need to be doing 140 damage with your firewall. Size 2, 260. Size 3, 380. And size 4, 500. So in this case, I do 600, so this cons is a size 3 or 4. So I don't really need to check it with a side hero because 600 damage will kill um, a size 4 as well. But if you don't, if you do like 380 damage, you certainly want to check this to make sure that this is a size 3 and not a size 4 because you certainly don't want to die. And the other thing that you need to know is that you need to outspeed the griffins, right? So if you have a cons where there is a stack of royal griffins, you want to bring sprites, the upgraded sprites, or an angel with you. Because what's going to happen if you just use the regular pixies like these, the griffins have a speed 9 and you have a speed 8 on highlands, and what's going to happen is they're going to skip their turn until the firewall actually disappears because they get to move first on the next turn and they will kill you. That has happened to me before. So just make sure that you can outspeed their royal griffins. So sprites work and angel works. Um, if you happen to have something like harpy hags, that uh, can work as well. So now for the demonstration. So this technique uses three firewalls and seven pixies. Basically, I sacrifice six of them to uh, bring the griffins closer together so that they can get burnt in just one turn. So first of all, we move a pixie here and immediately we use a closed wall like this. When you have a closed wall, hex two units, two hex units are not going to move for it. For whatever reason, the AI works this way. Um, they will move for it if you have an open wall or if you have a double wall. But if you have just a single closed wall like this, they're not going to move for it. So this pixie is definitely going to be safe. And the rest of them I just use to kind of bring the griffins closer together. So first I move all of them up. Second turn, immediately I do a double wall. This one skips her turn and the rest of them move down. So now you see the, the rest of the griffins are close enough together as to where they're going to get burnt by just uh, in just one turn. So now I use my third firewall and I skip my turn and that's it. Easy as that. Now I'm just going to show you guys how to do a cons on one pixie and four firewalls. If you happen to have a shortage of pixies or something like that, you may want to do this. But I prefer the first method because to me six mana is more valuable than six pixies. So I use the first method and I recommend the first method as well. But for whatever reason, sometimes you may be out of pixies or something like that. Uh, so this method, it also works. In this case, you're going to be using four firewalls. So first of all, the most important thing, you want to put the firewall here before moving here. Because that's going to be your turn. And if you move there first, you're not going to get a chance to put up the firewall. The griffins are just going to kill you and you'll die. So we put up the firewall, then we move here. And as you can see, they didn't move. So like I said, two hex units are not going to move for the firewall uh, if it's just a closed single wall like this. So turn two, 
I immediately put the second firewall up. It's gonna kill these two stacks. But as you can see, these two stacks are not gonna reach. So that's the reason, because they didn't move on turn one because of that closed wall. They're gonna be too far away. So I'm gonna have to use an extra firewall next turn. So if you happen to have a shortage of pixies, this is how you can do it on just um, one pixie. Okay, I hope that you guys found this video useful. And uh, if you guys want to see more Heroes 3 content, I do stream live on Twitch Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday around noon European time. So if you do want to check that out, I'll have the link uh, to the stream in the video description below. You can follow me on Twitch so you get notified when I go live. And do feel free to subscribe to this channel as well so you're notified when I release more videos. Alright, thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for more videos.